This is Tom Meets Interesting People. This episode contains frank and honest discussions about mental health and suicide. Tim, it's so good to finally have you here. It has been, we have been trying to get this to work for ages, but I'm glad our schedules are finally aligned. I, I won't lie, I am resisting the urge to just pitch to you the idea of us two starting our own wrestling podcast, because I reckon we could just make like five hour episodes. Oh, I swear yeah. we could. <laughs> Uh, I'll tell you who I don't love, who's a little overrated, and I don't like being negative, but is Dean, uh, not Dean Ambrose, uh, John Moxley. And this interview is terminated. No. <laughs> <laughs> My guest today is Tim McCarthy, who is the host of the 20 Tim Minutes podcast that explores mental health through humor, insight, and personal stories. Yeah, to having the phone turned off is, is huge. Um, I think because like I'm always on my phone, like you know how it is being a podcaster. Like yeah. you get a notification on Twitter, like this is it. I'm blowing up. This is <laughs> this is the big time. I was taking interviews on my days off, and I wasn't really yeah. taking care of myself. I, I'd be doing interviews before work, but doing them on my my days off, and I was just like getting worn down. And I'm like, I got to make sure I'm doing this for me as well. Yeah. Like I can't yeah. burn myself out, or there'd be no podcast. I learned that kind of almost the hard way where I was like, man, I'm getting run down. And like, mm -hmm. even a part of me was like, you know what? I should just shut down the whole podcast and get rid of it. I was having troubles probably between like 2017 to 2019 really bad. And I didn't really know it. Everything's kind of a blur because I was in a, such a bad place. I tell yeah. people all the time, if you see pictures or like saw me with my big beard, that's when I was at my worst. I wasn't showering. I wasn't, I wasn't taking care of myself. I was calling out of work. And like you come up with these uh, grandois like ideas that you'll never do. Like I was like, oh, I'm gonna build a dog house for my dog. I don't even know how to use a screwdriver, my friend. Wife and I weren't doing too good. My marriage was kind of falling apart. And like my relationships with friends were falling apart. I was very nasty. And 2019, I almost decided to kill myself uh, via hanging. And I remember looking at the calendar and then I waved to my dog and then I was walking upstairs and I felt like I had an outer body experience. And so I stood there with, with it around my neck and I just started crying like so much. And I was just standing there and then like I realized it was my brother's birthday and like it was my, my, um, my grandmother's uh, death day. And I was just like super depressed and I was just like kind of going in and out. And I was like getting ready to do it. And then like it's silly as it sounds, the person that knocked me out of it was my... I mean, I just want to reach through now and just give you a hug. Yeah, uh. <laughs> my man. I'm a big hugger too. I'm a huge hug guy. <laughs> 